Hey, welcome to a new video. My name is Lee Ellickson. Spend a, spend a little bit of time in my studio with me in this video. Here's my studio and here's me. Please also grab your, your water. I got myself a new bottle that does not leak. It is, I'm loving my new leak free life. It is naked. It is, it is naked. But um, I did put one Studio Meggie sticker on here, which brings me so much joy. There, it has like a little evil, smiley, happy face and live, laugh, love on it. It just really embodies the energy that I, I like to have. Don't always have, but the energy I do like to have. Thanks for coming out tonight, today, to this morning. Thanks for coming out. We're gonna do a little bit of art making this week. I, I did a surprising amount of art making this week that I, I didn't film all of it, but I was surprised when I was editing the footage how much I did film because I thought I filmed none of it. So that's nice. I've been, I've been indulging a bit in sketchbooking casually, just like trying to rearrange my my daily life to be more stress-free. I had like a few, I had a couple months where it was just like high stress, high, high energy. Everything with the moving and setting up a new studio and also doing my job, it was just like constant stuff. So I've been really trying to turn, turn that energy down a bit and just kind of live. So I have been enjoying that. It has been good. So cheers to that. I hope you liked the video. I think that's all I want to say in this intro. Smash the like button, smash the subscribe button. You won't regret it, because will you remember that you did it? <laughs> I hope you like this video and have a, a good little, a little watch with me. So get to your Wawa and we shall watch. If you're new here, I dance at the beginning and end of my videos. Why? I don't know anymore. I don't know anymore, you know? Beef jerky. Mmm. Mm. Chew it up. I would like to take this moment to thank our sponsor, Pila. Thank you, Pila, for sponsoring this video. Pila's mission is to create a waste-free future. They have created the world's first 100% compostable phone case. It will break down in your backyard or an industrial compost system if that's available to you. If you want to get 40% off your purchase of a Pila case, you can use the code LEE. The first 50 subscribers use the code get 40% off and after that you get 25% off. So thank you Pila for sponsoring this video. Hi, hello, I am filming this voiceover with my window wide open, what's new? Um, so if you hear ambient car noises, perhaps a dog barking, wind, birds, that is because my window's open and I love having my window open 
and I I just um, am, I'm adding a bit of ambient noise to my videos lately with the buzzing of my heater if you've heard that it is in this video so it is something to look forward to it's absolutely dreadful it's absolutely dreadful but a girl gotta stay warm you know but if you didn't read the text before I picked up a very large cheap sketchbook from my local art supplies supplies store struggled with that word a little bit huh i was at the art supply store like a day after i watched studio meggie's sketchbook tour video on patreon which i was so inspired by the way that she uses her sketchbook she talks a lot about other artists that kind of influence her and i was like you're influencing me um she was just she just uses her sketchbook so casually and i have never had a uh, i kind of have had a very casual sketchbook my last sketchbook tour was a very casual one but it was very small so i didn't feel like i had the right space to experiment and learn because i felt too compact so this sketchbook is 11 by 14 when it's closed meaning it's 22 by 14 when it's open which is very large 22 by 14 inches a typical piece of paper is 8 by 11 inches so so far i'm loving it loving it i'm having a lot of fun in it i've never had a sketchbook this big which is is fun i love doing new stuff and i've also have i also have not had a sketchbook that is this inexpensive this was just the run-of-the-mill very generic brand that is just at art supply stores like each art supply store has their own generic brand this is plaza's it, this cost me like 12 dollars for this huge sketchbook with a million spreads in it i am indulging in a bit of casual vibes in it Am I as casual as I imagine myself being? No, um, no, not really. It's not, it's, I am definitely more casual than usual. I have been working towards that with drawing more instead of painting more in my sketchbooks, even though my paintings are pretty casual in my sketchbooks. There's something about drawings that's just like super quick and not messy, but I am still, I'm still casual. Not as casual as, in, as I intended, but still casual. Um, I use some Poscas in it. I've been using my favorite pen here, which is a Pilot Bravo pen. I love these pens. And just drawing a little bit from life, scrolling through pictures I wouldn't usually use for reference photos because sometimes I just like, I'm searching and searching and searching for the perfect reference photo. And I'm, sometimes I just need to draw whatever comes up and it's it's been fun to have less less decision making and the doodling so um as a full review for the sketchbook i like it i i'm having fun it's also kind of secret and i have been loving secret art lately so shout out to studio maggie for making that video and um inspiring me to get this big boy
It's April 25th, 25th, no? Monday, April 25th. I'm not sure what, what I have for this vlog, footage-wise, because I took like three days off last week because I was going through an emotional whirlwind. Nothing, nothing serious, just a little bit of PMS, a little bit of a birthday, my birthday passed. I don't like birthdays, so I, I did take some time off. I played quite a bit of Kingdom Hearts. I, I beat Kingdom Hearts 2. If you have ever played Kingdom Hearts 2, crazy storyline. Absol absolutely crazy. So crazy that it's funny. But I did, I did want to film unboxing. I got a box from Sugar House Ceramic Co. You can't tell from the box. Well, you can from here. See? That's their stamp. The last box I got from them was so amazing and I got video of it, but I don't know where the footage went. And it was the most amazing box of goodies I've ever seen. I didn't know they were sending me anything. I don't know what's in here. I'm pretty thrilled. I have been honored to get package after package of beautiful things from fellow creators. I am blessed on this earth. So um, I thought we could open this as a way to ease back into, you know, being on camera. Did I say my window's open? My window's open. 
if you hear ambient noises of cars and birds and wind. It's a bit breezy today. It's going to rain later. Um, for all you Yeah Maybe listeners, we took this week off. Mostly because of me. I just couldn't muster up the energy and personality to film a podcast for this week. So we took our first week off since starting it. If you didn't know, James and I have a podcast called Yeah Maybe. We just kind of sit and chat. It's very casual and fun and really easy listening. We've been doing it for 30 weeks straight and we took a week off, which is so refreshing. It's not necessarily hard to do, but it does require me to be in a certain mood and I'm just not always in that mood. So let's unbox this. <laughs> They're so nice to me. Here's the insides. You see? First up, we got a magic eraser. So they send, I don't know if it, they call it a magic eraser, but it's something like that. When you clean your palettes and then there's like pigment stains on them, this will get it off. I think these are little, little towels, little tea towels. Yes, look at how cute. Same pattern as their cute wrapping paper. Lovely color. And this one, so cute. I, um, they posted, I love that I'm trying to get in the shot. They posted a, a picture, I don't know, a while, like week, months ago, I don't know. And I share them so much. One, because their palettes are beautiful and I use them every time I paint. But two, because they send me so much stuff and I'm like, I, I love your stuff. I love your brand. I love your creations. I'm gonna share them. Um, what am I saying? Yeah, so I love Sugar House Ceramico. And they posted, yes, they remember now. And they said, if we are Nike, Lee is our Michael Jordan. And I've never, this is so cute. <laughs> it's a little magnet. Um, I can't believe I'm doing this hand thing, but I am. Okay, you see it, it's adorable. Wow, that's super special. And I've never really loved a caption so much. It's so funny. And such a funny comparison between like an artist and a brand. I don't know, it just really hit home for me. And honestly, I'm honored to be compared to such a skilled b-ball player. Oh. Oops. Whoa. Whoa, look at this. It's like a pinch. Is this considered a mug? Pinch cup? It feels so good in my hand. This is adorable. Uh, uh, I can't. Wow, I am so lucky, you know? They are too sweet to me. In this cool little case. Oh, there's stuff in it. Look at this thing. Oh, we got little babies in here. We got this cute little pair of scissors. Little black scissors. I could use this for sewing. I sew sometimes. And then these cool pencils. And another box in the books from Sugar House Ceramico. I did receive, the, I, I don't want to adjust the camera, but I did receive this box when I was, when it was my birthday and I was hating my birthday and this box came on my birthday. So this is kind of a birthday present in my perspective. I don't think they knew it was my birthday, but so nice. Thank you, Sugar House Ceramico. Um, this is the maker. These are the makers that make the paint palettes I use all the time. If, if you have no context, um, the ceramic palettes, beautiful, beautiful ceramics and art supplies and tea towels I didn't know about. So thank you, Sugar House Ceramico. XOXO.
doing another unboxing. This one is from Natasha, AKA Sad Shrimps. And Casify, she did a line of cases with Casify and invited me to be a VI VIP. A VIP, meaning I get to get the cases and I love talking over me opening this. VIP, I guess, means that I get to get the cases first and I get to promo them. It didn't, it didn't, it didn't require me to promo them, did it? Either way, I'm gonna do it. I got two. I know I did ask for one, so let's see. Glitter filled, cute. Oh, there's a film on it. <laughs> wow. I did not know there was gonna be glitter in it. That's hypnotizing, no? Okay, that's case number one. Case number two. That was the design that I asked for. Then I got the cute tulip one too, in pink. Oh, look at her. Oh, there's something inside too. I've never had one of these cases. How does this work? It has like nice little bumpers on the inside. This feels like a really nice case. And it doesn't have like hard edges here. Like when it rests on your pinky and you get that weird callus cause there's like those hard edges. It doesn't have that. It is like a little thicker because you have to have room for the, you know, glitter. Um, party Ooh, it looks really cool on my red phone Ooh, ah I'm so VIP right now Natasha do you see me being VIP cute Thanks for making me VIP, Natasha, Hannah Montana. He won't stop drilling. Okay. This is someone to stop him. It's a little dramatic. This is a great day to test these. Yeah, are you gonna tell me what is it? We're putting up blackout curtains. You're drilling while I'm talking. They're blinds. Oh, sorry. We're putting in blackout blinds so we can have some darkness where the projector is. You can't have darkness without light. You can't have darkness without light. That's right. My channel is just James drilling stuff. Where, where James? <laughs> that's it. Oh, what? That's crazy. That's really dark. <laughs> Whoa. Very cool, huh? Whoa. Whoa. Wow. What? Looks yeah. like a garage door. Now imagine two of them. Whoa. You can make this place so dark. So dark. How does that work? I also put as close as I could to the window. Now the only problem is you kind of open the Yeah, I'm not tall enough. Wow. It blocked that sunlight right there. Right there. Sure. 
this area. Yeah. Like I am so hot standing here in front of the sun. Really? It's so hot. Car video sound. Tanya? It's pretty good for today. Magically disappears. I need to watch this movie. I haven't seen it in years. It's just okay. Yeah, no, it's still. I made an impromptu stop at the art supply store and picked up some, some stuff. First, I got some acrylic paints. I got a restock of my yellow um, and white, and then I got a fluorescent chartreuse, which I do not have and have never had, so I'm excited to work with that. I haven't had these for a while, and it's kind of been holding me back from doing larger work, so. I got those. I also got this fluorescent red. I've been working a lot with my fluorescent pink and I thought, hey, I think I'd like fluorescent red. So I got this and then I got this little, little yellow guy. I've had a few of these fluid acrylics and I really like working with them. I'd love to have a full set. And then I'm like, maybe I don't need one. So I, I just got one. I think that's a good idea. I also got four of my favorite pens. I recently got a restock of these. I got like three and then I was like, I need more because I want to give them to friends because a lot of people ask me what pen I use and I'm like, you know what? I can just give you one. So I'm going to have back stock and I'm going to have have these pens ready to go to give to people who want them. Plaza isn't always good about restocking them. so. I, I grab them when I can. And then I also got Posca pens. So I've, I've always had these colors, uh, but now they're starting to go dead. I've had them for like two or three years. So I got, I got more of these ones and then I got the pastel ones. I've never had these ones. I've only had the pink. So I'm excited to use these and I'm just noticing that that's off-white, which is lovely. I kind of thought I was getting two whites, but I'm not. I think the Poscas are very, are very fun.
How was the video? Was it good? I haven't finished editing it yet, so you tell me. Um, hello again, welcome to... Uh, uh, okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Hi, welcome to the end of the video. I hope that I hope that you enjoyed your time here. I I am enjoying my more low-key life this week. Luckily, it's the end of the month, which is usually my my chiller time because I like to get all my Patreon work done at the beginning of the month. I have to design stuff and edit stuff and order things and get to making the video and everything, but this week I have just been chilling. I'm, I'm just like doing whatever I want with no deadlines. So I have been very much enjoying this life. So I do, on that note, I do want to give a shout out to my little puppy patrons. Thank you for supporting me on Patreon. I got an influx of patrons from my last video because I changed the format of how you pay. So thank you for everyone who's joined and everyone who's stuck around or has been and can't stay. I um, so much appreciate your support. I said that's so weird, but um, thank you for being a little puppy patron for whatever time you have been. XOXO. Um, also, thank you everyone for watching to the end of the video. Very cool. Leave me a comment about your favorite vegetable. I, I haven't, I haven't um, contributed to the comments. I haven't said my favorite dog, my favorite cat, and I'm, I'll tell you my favorite vegetable, uh, which is kind of a hard question for me, but I do really like carrots. I don't like them cooked though. I like raw carrots. Don't at me. I like raw carrots, not baby carrots. Do not come at me with baby carrots. No, we do full carrots. Thank you again for watching to the end of the video. Give me a thumbs, thumbs up like this um subscribe to my channel if you made it this far and you are not it just feels like that's it feels logical at this point no yes yeah and have a good one out there i hope you are you are also living a semi-stress-free life or this video gave you a little a little break from your stressful life because life can be very stressful it's kind of crazy and i know that so i'm just Sending you good vibes. Here you go. Have it. Okay, bye.